honoring a historic day in hockey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one we can be uh, very proud of from all the way across the United States, John. Yeah, it's very cool. A, a great moment at the Boston Bruins game. San Diego and Willie O'Ree was recognized for breaking hockey's color barrier 64 years ago tonight. O'Ree, who later played for the San Diego Gulls, became the first black player in the NHL 64 years ago tonight. At the time, he was 22 years old and blind in one eye. More than six decades later, his number 22 jersey was retired and hung in the rafters in Boston. For the last 24 years, O'Ree has been a diversity ambassador for the NHL, still going strong at the age of 86. During my last visit to Boston, one of the highlights was seeing these young boys and girls from Hockey is for Everyone skating on the ice at TD Gardens. Looking up at the icons and legends hanging from the rafters, I never imagined my jersey would join them. From a young age, my heart and my mind was set on making it to the NHL. I am grateful and honored it was with the Bruins. This is an unforgettable day. I am overwhelmed and thrilled to be a part of the Bruins forever. O'Ree reading from that prepared statement attended the ceremony virtually. So him reading that was heard by all the fans in Boston and he should be a sportscaster. That guy knows how to read from a prepared statement with no teleprompter, much less. Uh, I interviewed Willie a few years ago. True honor to meet him and spend time with him. A great guy.